All right, here comes the update. All the baseboards are in except for, you know, a couple of the bedrooms. And we'll start that tomorrow. Office door is in. We're going to put the knobs on and tear that plastic off. That's just overspray. But as you can see, the baseboards are in. I went with the wider baseboards for this one. And it looks so beautiful. And it looks even better when the crown molding is in. As you can see, baseboards are in. This is the dining room. Nice light for the dining room. Coming into the kitchen and the living room area, you know, baseboards are in. Everything is looking good, you know. Lights are in for the breakfast area. Look at the baseboards. We got the wider ones. It looks so good. Got all the recess lights in. The ceiling fan is missing the blades because uh, we still got to touch up the texture and things like that. But as you can see, all the baseboards are in, even in the kitchen, even on the island. We still got to put texture on the island and paint. But the kitchen is in, as you can see, it looks a lot bigger now that it has the 44 inch upper cabinets. And uh, <coughs> all the recesses are in. And as you can see, it's ready for granite. Uh, we're getting two granite guys. One already came and one is coming a little later to give us uh, some better pricing. But as you can see in the bathroom, baseboards are in, everything is set up, ready to go for the granite. Even the light is in. So we just gotta put the granite in and add a framed mirror. But yeah, yeah, look at it. So, yeah, everything looking good. Giving the closet, giving the closet, got the baseboards in. Okay. And this is the master bedroom, master bathroom. The guy already came and measured for the frameless glass for the shower. And as you can see, the baseboards are already in. Even the other closet, also the baseboards are already in. The lights are already hung. We're gonna patch that hole. We got the vanity coming for that. The guy already measured for the frameless, the frameless uh, glass that's gonna go halfway up this wall and halfway in, so you can put shampoo in. As you can see, the little bench, nothing is there other than the hardy board because we're gonna put granite on top of that. You know. Um, so once the frameless glass goes in and the granite bench goes in, you know, that thing will look amazing. Holes patch. And this time I'm gonna do one big mirror instead of two separate. That's gonna look pretty good. But just giving you an update, everything's looking good. Tomorrow morning, bright and early, we start the crown molding. And we'll, well, we'll finish the, the couple bedrooms and then we'll start the crown molding. And we're pretty much on the home stretch, just crown molding, doors, you know, um, you got crown molding, you got doors, you got the handles, hinges, you know, it's the home stretch now. You know, we fell a little bit behind, but I think we caught up now, because even the outside is painted and looking good. We got to power wash the front, but as you can see, when you walk around, I did the flip-flop so what I did and uh, the Sun isn't doing me any justice but it had dark color with light trim and I reverse it and now I got light color with dark trim let me walk you down a little bit into better shade let's see if you could see that color pop a little better but as you can see you see that you notice that that is reverse it's the light color with the dark trim I think that looks a lot better and uh, there we go Looking good.